canothenic acid. So this is going to be used for the synthesis or oxidation of amino acids, um, used again in the metabolism of carbohydrates, fats, and proteins, um, also in the production of glycogen. Um, panothenic acid is synthesized by bacteria in our gut, um, so it is one of those. And the big, um, I guess the unique thing about panothenic acid is that it is needed to synthesize coenzyme A, which is a carrier for acetyl groups, which if you think of acetyl-CoA, I think of biochem and I think of the Krebs cycle. So basically, panothenic acid is the door to the Krebs cycle, which is the door to metabolism, right? Um, <clears throat> so pantothen in Greek means from everywhere. Uh, so the sources of panothenic acid is a little bit in everything, um, but majorly seen in salmon, pork, avocados, yay, um, yogurt, sweet potatoes, uh, what other sources do I have? Eggs, kidneys, yeast, grains, legumes, a little bit and everything. But um, so kind of fun though to know that avocados are a good source of panothenic acid. Um, which is going to be helping um, create coenzyme A, the door to the Krebs cycle and metabolism. Uh, deficiencies in pinothenic acid is really rare because it is in a little bit of everything, but if there is a deficiency, there might be a decrease in appetite, depression, fatigue, and sleep disorders.